Okay, um, oxidation state of non-metal. Let's see the notes. Huh? Okay, so this is the oxidation state of non-metal. Now for metal, eh, oxidation state of metal, usually we know the charge of the metal and, and that is the oxidation state of the metals. Eh? Okay, so for example, let's say aluminum oxide, Al2O3, right? Okay, so we know that the charge of aluminum is uh, positive 3, eh? 3 positive, and therefore we know that the oxidation state of this aluminum is 3 positive. So usually we have no problem with the oxidation state of metal. Eh? The problem is the oxidation state of non-metal because non-metal usually they have more than one oxidation state okay so therefore uh, you need to do some calculations uh, to find the oxidation state of the non-metal so examples uh, example here you try to do the first four uh, this one and i will give you the answer later after this tell the oxidation number of the underlying elements uh, or uh, the sulfur okay the sulfur Okay, and tell and uh, write your answer here. This is the calculations and this answer should be no problems right okay those uh, we don't know we put x okay those we know okay uh we just write two oxygens two times negative two and this is equal to the sum of the charge sum of the charge or uh, sum of the oxidation state is equal to the charge eh? the charge equal to zero so then we get positive four oxygens eh? it can have three oxidation state it can have three oxidation state eh? for example o2 the oxidation state is zero okay h2o the oxidation state is negative two h2o2 the oxidation state is negative one okay so usually this one is seldom come out okay it seldom come out this is peroxide okay and uh, the only peroxide that you need to know is h2o2 but usually it, it, it it's uh usually it won't come out okay uh, the compounds of oxygens eh? okay if it's o2 this is elements uh, then the oxidation state is zero okay but in the compound the oxidation state of oxygen is always negative two so that's why you, you always see negative two okay you always see negative two because this one it's uh it seldom come out okay but uh, we can't say that the oxidation state is just negative two no it can be negative one but it seldom come out okay and also this oxygen o2 the oxidation state is zero okay so
Okay, so if you have done, then you can check your answer here. Uh, this is a working. It's a working, and this is the answer. Okay. Okay, you can see that uh, there's no underlined. Uh, please put the underlined for the chlorine. Chlorine. Chlorine, and this one for bromine. Uh, bromine iodine. Okay. Do this, uh, find the oxidation number of the chlorine here. Okay, so this answer, uh, except the first one, negative one, uh, the others are positive, okay? And this, these are the working. Let's proceed to the last one. The last four, uh, bromine and iodine, okay? These are the answer, and these are the working. Should be no problem, right?